This is red stem fillery. It is a plant in the geranium family Geraniaceae and is a native to Eurasia that has become naturalized throughout North America. It is a winter annual or biennial that flowers from spring to fall. The plant forms a low-lying rosette of leaves from which grows prostrate or upright stems. The stems are bright red and the entire plant is covered in soft, fine hairs. The leaves are compound with leaflets that are deeply lobed and feather-like. The leaves are finely hairy, have a red midrib, and may have reddish or purplish margins. The flowers are born in small clusters of two or more and are a light purple in color. The five lobed fruits are very distinct, being long horn-like pods that point directly upwards. They will mature from light green to dark brown, and when dry will crack apart and eject their seeds. The seeds themselves have a very unique form of further dispersing themselves. Each seed is attached to a long awn that will curl as it dries, and uncurl as it gets wet again. This process is rather quick and allows the seed to effectively crawl across the soil to find a secure location. Once it finds a crevice or hole in the substrate, the curling action of the awn will drill the seed into the soil, sometimes as deep as one inch. This ensures that it is well placed to germinate in a location that will facilitate healthy growth. The awn itself will then disconnect to prevent the seed from being removed. The curling awns are also capable of catching onto fur and clothing, and the seeds will remain viable for many years. The plant grows from a shallow taproot and only reproduces via seed. It often forms dense mats of plants and gives off a distinct odor when damaged. Red stem fillery likes disturbed soils and plenty of moisture and sun. It is common in gardens and fields and is often found among cultivated crops, though it is not an overly invasive or damaging weed. The entire plant is edible.